Factory farm waste contaminates humans and the environment. The World Health Organization reports that the swine flu has continued to spread as the number of cases jumped by a thousand overnight for the second time to a total of more than 8,450 confirmed in 39 countries and 73 confirmed fatalities. India and Turkey just reported their first new cases. Some researchers maintain that one most likely source of the influenza, as well as other pathogens, is industrial-scale livestock operations, such as the one where the first cases of swine flu were reported. Thousands of pigs are housed along with their feces, which are then subjected to high-speed fans. There, the outflowing air, flies and excrement all could carry pathogens far from the farm to communities while degrading the natural environment. Supreme Master Television spoke with Patty Lovera, Assistant Director of Food and Water Watch in the U.S., about the pollution and health threats inherent in factory farms, where she pointed out the complex range of health problems that arise from untreated manure. You know, in North Carolina, for many years in the 90s, there was this mysterious illness called fisteria, and you know, a lot of people concluded that it was coming from. Um, you know, a kind of a toxic algae that was really thriving on pollution in the water that came from hog facilities. Other types of intensive farms, such as chicken operations, likewise have a far-reaching impact on the environment and human health. A perennial complaint about the water quality in the Chesapeake Bay is the contribution to pollution of the bay made by the chicken factory farms because they have so much waste and they, and they apply it to fields, but it's over-applied. It's too much nitrogen, it's too much phosphorus, and it just, it's feeding right into the bay. Does that uh, provide any public health threats um, in rural areas or in city areas? Yeah, it does. So, for example, in a big body of water like the Chesapeake Bay, you, you see the whole balance be thrown off and different types of algae take over because they're feeding off the the nitrogen and the phosphorus, and that messes up um, you know, the oxygen levels, it messes up what fish can live there, so you're really changing that whole ecosystem. Our thanks to Miss Lavera and Food and Water Watch for your efforts in helping raise awareness of the threats posed by animal farming practices. We continue to pray that the suffering of swine flu is minimized as people across the globe are awakened to the understanding that the simple act of foregoing meat brings health and peace of mind to all lives. Cholera linked to dog meat. At least 100 cases of cholera have erupted in northern Orlac or Vietnam, with 30 to 40 new illnesses being diagnosed daily. The cases are being linked to consuming dog meat, with the virulent virus also found to be present at the places of slaughter. Cholera is an infectious gastrointestinal disorder that in its severe form can be quickly fatal. We are deeply saddened at the spread of this life-threatening disease and pray for the recovery of the afflicted. May illnesses such as these become a thing of the past, as humans protect the life of every animal and better health is known to all. Some of the diseases related to meat consumption and or production. Swine flu. Cured meats and fish increase leukemia risk in children. Antibiotic resistant superbug infections from a strain of Staphylococcus aureus. Flu tongue disease. E. coli. Salmonella. Bird flu. Mad cow disease or creutzfeldt jakob disease. 90% of the population at risk. Pig's disease or PMWS. Listeriosis, shellfish poisoning. Preeclampsia, Campylobacter, Clostridium difficile. Diseases hidden in healthy appearing livestock. Some of the costs of meat eating. Infertility, eating just one serving of meat per day increases the risk of women's infertility by 32% with additional meat consumption increasing the risk. Heart disease. Over 17 million lives lost globally each year. Cost of cardiovascular disease is at least 1 trillion U.S. dollars a year. Cancer. Over 1 million new colon cancer patients diagnosed each year. More than 600,000 colon cancer-related mortalities annually. In the United States alone, colon cancer treatment costs about 6.5 billion U.S. dollars. Millions of people are newly diagnosed with other meat-related cancers every year. 
diabetes. 246 million people are affected worldwide. An estimated 174 billion US dollars spent each year on treatment in just the United States. Obesity. Worldwide, 1.6 billion adults are overweight with 400 million more who are obese. Costs 93 billion US dollars each year for medical expenses in the United States alone. At least 2.6 million people die annually from problems related to being overweight or obese. Environmental. Use up to 70% of clean water. Pollute most of the water bodies. Deforest the lungs of the earth. Uses up to 43% of the world's cereal. Uses up to 85% of the world's soy. Cause world hunger and wars. 80% cause of global warming. Plus more. Some of the costs of milk consumption. Bacterial microbes, pesticides, and enzymes found in cheese derived from the inner stomach linings of other animals. Up to 80% of the calories in cheese are from pure fat. Breast, prostate, and testicular cancer from hormones present in milk. Listeria and Crohn's disease. Hormones and saturated fat leads to osteoporosis, obesity, diabetes, and heart disease. Linked to higher incidences of multiple sclerosis. Classified as a major allergen. Lactose intolerance. Plus more. For more urgent information, please visit suprememastertv.com forward slash harms dash benefits dash flyer.